Welcome everybody to Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm an old guy gaming and I'm going to start a new series playing uh, this awesome game. Been wanting to play it for a long time. I know it's been out for about two years, but uh, just now getting around to playing it. Never played Red Dead 1 because it's uh, only been on console and I, I typically only do PC games. However, I am watching Red Dead 1 on YouTube, watching another YouTuber go through it so that I can get the story. Uh, from what I understand, uh, Red Dead 1 is actually uh, actually takes place chronologically after Red Dead 2. So Red Dead 2 is really kind of a prequel to Red Dead 1. The other thing uh, I'll let you know is that uh, I did start watching Red Dead 2 on YouTube and I got, I don't know, about an episode or two into the person I was watching. And I decided that, you know what? I'm going to stop watching this. I'm going to go buy the game and play it myself. And so that's where we are. So this is going to be a blind playthrough. Um, I do know what happens in, you know, the first few uh, opening scenes, of course, because I've watched it. But uh, once we get past uh, a certain point, you know, then it'll be a completely blind playthrough for me. Uh, the other thing, too, is that I'm going to have a minimal monologue here during this, uh, this playthrough, because especially at the beginning... Because this is a very story-driven game. The story is really important, and it's really good, too, from what I understand. Even though I don't really know much about it, I've just been told that the story is really fantastic. So I'm not going to talk as much as I normally would in a Let's Play. And uh, the other thing, too, is I, I am going to keep the camera on, but I have the camera uh, shrunk down smaller than normal, too, just so that you guys you know can see reactions and so forth, but um, you know, we're gonna just play the game. We're gonna enjoy. It. We're gonna immerse ourselves in the game. And like I said, there's gonna be minimal uh, talking on my part. And um, I think that's really pretty much it. So let's get started. Here we go. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Chapter 1, Coulter. Mrs. 
Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we going to do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're going to stay here, and you were going to get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're going to ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. Ready? We're on. Press W to follow. Uh, hold W to match speed with Dutch. Come on. Let's go. Ain't sure what we're going to find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. That snow looks so realistic. Hold the uh, left shift to ride faster. <laughs> Careful over this bridge here. Left control to slow your horse down. Okay. Davey, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. A right click to talk Dutch. But what about the money? And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Whoa. 
Micah. Gentlemen, found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Are you sure about this? You run into anybody else? You run into anybody else? I, I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. <laughs> Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. It ain't much, shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Right. Talk to Micah. Further? Idiot. Stop lying like a damn fool. What happened? Did I run Not into somebody? Far. What's happening? What does that mean? Not far. Uh, thanks. Oh, God damn, this snow gets right to the bone. Yeah, it looks cold out. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Stop and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Whoa! Okay, let's head down there. Health is displayed in the lower left corner. Okay. The outer bar shows your remaining health. The level of the inner core influences how quickly your health refills. Okay. Approach the hitching posts. Hold E to hit your horse. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. Follow Dutch. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. <laughs> Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. I could get down behind that wagon in front. Okay, he wants me to go here. Go to the shed and then press Q to take cover. By the way, I, I am playing this on PC. I don't know if I specified that, but uh, yeah, wait on PC. Okay, so Q is how we take cover. Good to know. W to Hello? peek out of cover. Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello. Oh, well. Hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Oh, there's a guy over there. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. Oh, there's four of them. Arthur, Arthur we got a problem. 
There's a corpse right here. Oh crap. Now I, I just Arthur. need some There's a body food in the wagon. Uh, Protect is. Dutch. Keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. Okay, hold tab to show the weapon down. wheel. Use the mouse to select and release to equip. All right, let's select our pistol. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am kind of desperate. Okay, so we have four hey, bad guys. I don't believe it. Come here, partner. From the window, he said. Okay. There's a guy right there. Oh, we shot his hat off. <laughs> okay, stick your head out, dude. Come on, get that head out. That guy's like right there. Come on, reload. Press W to climb. One was making a run for it. Uh, this way. I guess the little red stuff on the compass shows us what's going on. So. All right. Can we can we loot this guy? Turn to Dutch. No, I guess not. Okay. What's that mean? Does that mean I'm getting too cold or something? Doesn't. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn, O'Trisco boys here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn Hold up. Are near down. items to pick them Grab up while searching the house. As you can. Uh, okay. Food, Whiskey. Uh, your health core drains over time and is now empty. While empty, you will experience negative effects. Hold B to open your satchel. Eat a provision to restore some health core. So. Okay. That didn't restore it a whole lot. Here, let's do another one. Let's do one more here. Going all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One okay. Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Examine. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. Toggle view. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it Zoom. Down. Flip. Uh, Jake and Lady Sadie. I think that's Sadie. Wedding, Place September 1896. September 4th, 1896. Move the women and Jack down here. Maybe we'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Okay, let's see what else we can pick up here. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Gold jointed bracelet. You'd think the uh, outlaws in here would have taken that. Inspect card. I. Join. Uh, World Champions card six. Huh. Okay. Let's keep looking around for more stuff. Salted meat. Or beef, rather. Okay. 
Health cure. More health cure. And more health cure. Okay. Anything over here? Assorted biscuits. Man, lots of stuff here. Canned sweet corn. Close cabinet. Alright, so it looks like it takes them a while to loot stuff, but I guess that's I guess that's realistic compared to uh answer. Still looking, Dutch. Um, I guess that's realistic compared to just opening a crate and taking everything instantly. Okay, I don't see anything else there. I think we got everything out of here. We already went to this table when we first come in, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, there's a ladder. Hold W while approaching the ladder, okay. Looks like there's some more stuff here. More oat cakes. Six revolver cartridges. All right, is that it? Doesn't seem to be anything else over that way. I must have crouched on accident. All right, where does this... Did we go all the way over here? Looks like it said blood when we walked near that blood on the floor in there. All right, I guess we got to go talk to Dutch. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, okay, we'll go, go check the barn. Cabin, see what we missed. Did we look in this little chicken yeah. coop thing? Nothing in there. Investigate the barn. All right, so it looks like it puts like a little yellow X thing on our mini map in the lower left corner. Press left alt to view your current objective again. Uh, all that does is pause thing. Okay, so expanded. Oh, okay, so that makes the mini map larger. I see. Regular compass Z. Regular. That just change it, changes it to the smaller size. Expanded is like a big size and regular is regular size. Okay, we'll just keep it on regular. When using the compass, you can press left alt to briefly display the full radar again. Oh, he pulled his gun out. Oh, shit. Uh, F to attack Driscoll. I just, I guess I just keep spamming F, so there's, doesn't appear to be any strategy to melee combat, it's just mashing the key. Okay, hold Not right now to focus on Driscoll. Bye. Grab what the O'Driscoll. And where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. And then, uh, question. Just press the left mouse button. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. All right, question. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. 
Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. Okay, choke, spare, go. or beat. Please. Well, um, let's punch him again. And maybe one more time. <laughs> but I don't I don't think I want to just like kill him in cold blood here, so we'll let him go. Go. Pick up your gun. Oh we drop oh yeah, I guess we dropped him when we got jumped. Pick up tab. Pick up your hat. Uh, R. Why did the why did it have me use tab to pick up the gun and R to pick up the hat? That doesn't make sense. Okay, hold right mouse button to focus on the horse. Let's get a look closer to him first. Calm the horse. Pat. It's a nice looking horse. Horse bonding achieved, level one. Oh, cool, okay. E for lead. Continue to bond with your horse. Continuing to bond with your horse increases its trust in you and improves its attributes. Oh, okay, that's good. Lead the horse to the hitching post. You let him go, huh? So a little bastard scurrying off. Yeah. Figured he won't get far in this anyway. He probably that won't. Looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Get that horse hitch. Don't want him bolting. Hitch horse. Investigate the noise inside the house. Oh. Micah, what the hell do you think you're doing? Hold still. Oh, I found in the cellar. Why a big ain't you? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them old Driscoll's. No, she ain't, Micah. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh, crap. I think Mike is a bit of a hothead. Miss, now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come yeah, on. I'd say so. Oh. <laughs> you okay, miss? They came three days ago. And father's been me. Miss, you are safe now. And can't stay here. Didn't take long for that house Come to us. get engulfed in flames. Yes, it's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. Uh, we're bad men, okay. but we ain't them. <laughs> get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Sadie. Oh, she must have been the lady in the, I, the photo. He... He was my husband. Yep, yeah, her husband's dead. Bummer. Easy there, Dutch cowboy. Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. And that's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up, give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? 
Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Enter, pursued by a memory. He ain't been seen in days. The weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? She wants you... something from us. I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. This looks really cool. Very realistic looking. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Okay, we have control There's again. Some tracks leading to the river. Horse health is displayed in the lower left corner. Your horse will collapse if its health bar fully depletes. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, horse stamina is displayed in the lower left corner. Stamina drains when your horse gallops or jumps. Okay. Man, it's hard to see. It seemed fine, and suddenly they were everywhere. Hunters? Your horse will not oh, gallop Pinker. when its stamina is empty. Slow down. Slowing down will allow your horse Raining to regain stamina. Okay. Sorry, guys. They they keep flashing these tips Watch up while these guys are talking. I wish they wouldn't do that. To change camera distance, perspective, press V. Dutch killed a girl in a um, bad way. I'm pressing V. But it was a bad situation. I ain't like him though. The tracks uh, lead this way, Arthur. Do I hold V? Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is not a good place to be. <laughs> he messing around with the camera controls. Right next to a big crevasse here. All right, I'll figure it out later. Davey got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. To activate cinematic camera, hold V. Bad business, all right. Oh. While That's viewing cinematic camera, your horse will automatically again. follow roads and other Who paths. Okay, hold on. What the hell's going on here? Okay. So, I need to get on the path. And then if I hold V. To change cinematic camera, press C. Oh, okay. So, these are just different angles. Oh, that's cool. I love it. 
To exit, press V. Okay. Watch yourself. It's not very wide here. Turn this way, Hoss. Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. It's like a carcass or something. Yeah, that's what it is. Hey, John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's, let's see if he can hear us. Oh, is he gonna start an avalanche? Oh, that's probably not a good idea. <laughs> Come on. I live in Colorado, so we have avalanches here. So I don't know. Okay, so it sounds sounds like we. Uh, Heard him over this way. Yeah, there he is. He's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further than the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grab that shotgun. You from can horse. you can only carry one sidearm at a time. You can swap your carried weapons with weapons stored on your horse. Appro approach the saddle on your horse. Okay. You getting that gun then? Working on it. Uh, hold tab to view your stored weapons. Okay. Um, use Q or E to select the sawed-off shotgun. Ah, nice. Okay. Uh, press uh, release tab to equip. Okay, so we just walk up to the saddle, hold tab, and then we can pull out whatever's in there. Uh, Tennessee Walker. Oh, is that the name of my horse? Right-click. Study. I don't know what just happened there. Horse, horse weapons. Oh yeah, that's what we just did. Horse cargo is B. Oh okay, cool. So the so we can load stuff into the horse too. That's the little saddle icon. Gotcha. Okay, so these are just different filters for our, our, what's in our inventory. Okay, let's go. You okay back there? Hold hold on a second, Javier. So what is this? Um. Okay, we can pat him. Does that give us more horse bonding? Yeah, good boy. And then what is show info cue? Yes, can. Come on. Oh, okay. So it just brings up like his stats. Gotcha. Okay. This is your main horse. All right. I think I think we're figuring this out. See you later, Tennessee Walker. Okay, let's go. We gotta go rescue old John. Oh man, this is a little precarious. I don't think I'd want to slip and slide down that thing. Look how steep this is. Careful here. Are you sure? Are you sure about this? Oh, yeah. oh, he's over there. It's coming from this way. Okay. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Stamina is displayed in the lower left corner and the outer bar depletes when you run, jump, or climb. The level of inner core influences how quickly your stamina refills. Okay. Yeah, that's... So this whole inner core idea seems to apply to health and stamina. Ooh. Yeah, this is treacherous, man. Holy crap. Okay, left control to crouch. Okay, from here. Watch your stamina core is empty. Your movement slip. speed will be limited. Oh, is that what the flashing blue thing is? I think Up that's what way. that means. Uh, you can access your satchel by holding B. Item effects are shown at the bottom of the satchel. Eat. Oh, right here. Okay. Uh, eat a provision with the stamina core icon to refill your stamina core. With the stamina core icon. So that's the lightning bolt thing. I don't see the icon on these. Well, okay. 
sounds closer now. Come on. We'll figure it out. <laughs> Remember, I'm brand new to this, you guys. Brand new. And and you know that guy I told you I watched for just like the first very part of this game, he was on um console anyways, not even on PC, so we are really learning this blind. This is cool looking though, man. Check this place out. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John! Call the John. Marston! Oh, that's Marston? Like John Marston from Red Dead 1? John, you there? Oh, wow, that's cool. Because remember, this is this is actually a prequel to Red Dead 1. That does sound like him too. As mentioned at the very beginning, I am I am watching Red Dead One on YouTube because they don't have it on PC, so I just want to watch it for the story. Yeah, that's Marston. Cool. That's quite a scratch you got there. There he is. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. So that's how he got his scar, huh? Wow. He is messed up. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. Freezing. Yeah, he looks like he's in pretty rough shape. Just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. What if he has broken ribs? <laughs> well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Uh, you all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. So they found a better way out. Oh, crap. You see that on the ridge? That's not good. Perfect. Is it those wolves that attacked him? I'll distract him while you get to the horses. Go! Draw them off. Okay, okay, keep the wolves away from Javier and John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Oh, here they are. Okay. We'll get you out of here. Oh shit! Reload quick! Okay, we got him. Got him. And we gotta reload. Whew, okay. We got bit, but I think we're I think we're okay. Can we like skin this thing? No. Alright, let's get going before more of them show up. Our horse isn't uh too comfortable right now, I can't blame him. So we still have our shoddy out. Come on then. Let's get back to the yeah, let's get going. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Might have to put a bandage on my own arm. Of course, I got pretty thick uh, coat on. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Of course there are. Where's my, uh, I can't see my freaking, uh, uh, sight. Where's, oh, there it is. What? I'm having trouble seeing my sight. Okay, we got him and we ran over him. <laughs> okay, whatever works, right? Yeah, I, I couldn't see the site. I don't know if it was lost in the okay. snow or some something else. Okay, Thanks press tab to put away and equip weapons. Oh, this. just tap it. Okay. Not a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now.
I should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. Tranquilo. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Some help! We need some help here! Come on, help him down. You're alive! You're alive! Oh, here we go. There we go. Oh. Ay, oh. careful, idiotas! It's his leg! <laughs> oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're gonna get out of this. I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that... that civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Events and interesting locations are noted in your journal as you explore. Hold J to view. Mission complete. Hold F1 for details. Log. Mission brief. Enter. Pursued by a memory. John hasn't returned from an earlier scouting trip. Arthur and Javier ride out into the snow to look for him. Kill all wolves without taking any damage to complete with at least 80% accuracy. Well, <laughs> I blew that, didn't I? <laughs> oh, well, that's okay. You know what? I th These little achievement things are fun to do, and they prob we probably get some kind of award for them, but I'm really playing this game mostly just to enjoy it and just enjoy the story and, you know, and become immersed in it. So, you know, I'm not going to go out of my way necessarily to do this stuff. Um, you know, well, we'll see how things go, but... Uh, at this point, I just want to enjoy the story. That's really what it's about for me. Okay, so um, Storm breaks, we move. let's uh, but we're safe here. let's listen to their dialogue Storm first. Enough. I guess you sound doubtful. Not doubtful, just worried. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. Sit. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. Okay, I think that's all they're going to say. So, looking on our mini-map, we have like a little tent here. So, I guess this is like our our room. Um, so, let's search the, the drawer here. Open, opened healthcare cure. Opened. Oh, okay. So, I guess we've already used it. We have something over here we can loot. Yeah, search drawer. Close drawer, take. Four classic oat cakes. All right, that's that's what I'm talking about. Um, what, what does it say? Oh, close the door. Drawer. Right. We got anything over here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so. Um, this is our bed here, so doesn't 
give us an option to sleep in it. Search. I think we already looked at that. So how do we save the game? Let's go to let's go to help and combat crime activities horse. Let's look at general, I guess. Story chapters, strain oh, there's a lot of good information in here. I'm gonna have to read this. I I, I won't do it on camera, of course, but um set the world see the world get around sleep save saving this game uses an automatic save system and your progress will be saved when you complete story chapters so i guess we just did that saving within your camp and whilst progressing through certain actions don't switch off your console while the saving icon is displayed okay that doesn't apply to us uh, so it says we can save in our camp so yeah i'm going to come back here and read read through all this stuff later it looks like some good information so it doesn't look like there's any way to save here. Would we go, what's progress? That's probably just how far, we're 1% done with the story, okay. All right, let's go back here. Um, player, Arthur Horse. What's that do? Weight perfect, temperature fair, honor. Oh, so, so I'm assuming there must be some kind of an honor system here then. Health is at 97%. Core time remaining 102. Core drain rate. Stamina remaining. Okay, that's cool. So that's just kind of like our stats then. Uh, well, okay, I'll look at that stuff again later. Let's see. Story. Save game right here. Okay, so we got an empty slot here. I guess we just click in that slot. Alert. Are you sure you want to save your current game progress? in a new Yes. Okay, cool. So that's how we save the game. Awesome. All right. But apparently we have to be in our camp to do that. So, uh, all right, let's go back this way. Online, social club, settings, quick game. Okay. Uh, oh, map. We haven't looked at the map yet. Oh, that's cool looking. Okay, so we have a map here. We are in Coulter right now. We can add a marker with Z. Ah, okay. How do you, how do we get rid of it? Oh, we select it and press Z to remove it. Okay, cool. And a waypoint is to press enter. So index Q. So these are my current waypoints, I guess. Ah, okay. Can we, can we add a waypoint though? Whoops. Yeah, I didn't mean to exit it. Or is the markers considered our waypoints? Add a marker, index. So if I wanted to put a waypoint here and I press enter, doesn't do anything. So I guess waypoints are, are things that the game adds and markers are the thing are things that I add. I guess that's what that means. Okay, well, we'll figure it out. Let's continue on. So it said that um, that if we look on the mini map, there's a P and a B. So I guess those are like objectives that we need to go go to. What I think that means. All right, well, you guys, I think this is probably a good place for us to 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 end uh, part one here. What I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and do these episodes. They're going to be around an hour long because I I think there's just too much going on with this game to do 30 minute episodes in other words i don't want to be like in the middle of a, of a story of a quest or you know a, a whatever it's called and then you know get 30 minutes into it and then stop the video i'm I'm, try, I'm gonna try not to do that so we're gonna shoot for about hour long episodes maybe a little more than that sometimes maybe a little less than that sometimes but i think that's probably going to be appropriate uh for this particular game so we will um pick up right where we left off in the next episode at this point and continue on um, I'm really liking this, you guys. This is cool. This is really cool. And I've, you know, I've heard so many good things about this game. It's got, you know, a real high rating on, on, uh, on Metacritic and on Steam. And, um, you know, it, I've always intended to play it. I just, you know, hadn't gotten around to it until now. So I, I think we're going to really enjoy this. And I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Uh, if you did, please, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Leave a like. 
and leave a comment. I do want to ask you one thing about the comments, though. If you are already familiar with this game, please do not leave any spoilers whatsoever. You can certainly leave tips and tricks uh, for me and help me learn the game, but uh, please don't leave anything that would even hint, um, you know, as being a spoiler, because I really want to enjoy this game, and I want other people who are watching it for the first time to also enjoy the game. So no spoilers. I would re really appreciate that. And with that, we'll catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.